Hello and welcome to the first in this festive series for The Taste Kitchen. Over the next seven weeks, we'll be bringing you hints and tips on everything from cooking your Christmas turkey right the way through to serving the best cocktails for your friends. So don't forget to press the subscribe button to make sure you don't miss out. Now, for you traditionalists out there, you've probably already got your Christmas cake prepped and ready for the festive period. However, for the rest of us, myself included, we may need a little help. And who better to come to the rescue than Claire Zerny? Hi Claire, great to see you. Good to be here. Two great cakes and a pud. Indeed. Couldn't get any better than this, could it? That's great. I'm going to start with Aldi because they have a great range of Christmas products in store at the moment. And here we've got the specially selected Golden Top Christmas Pudding. I have to say, I think this is really, really good. And I think I haven't really seen Christmas puddings done like that before, where you can see the candied oranges and it just looks like it's completely jammed with fruit. It looks great. And great with a scoop of ice cream yeah, as well. Yeah, yum. And under £10, great value. Really good. Moving on to the traditional Christmas cake, it's a specially selected exquisite Christmas cake um, and I absolutely love that. Yeah, it looks really cute. Again, under £10, so it's great value. However, if you want an alternative Christmas cake, Claire has brought <laughs> one in. What is it? Tell us about it. Well, it's a gingerbread cake and I just, I love gingerbread and I think it's a really traditional thing, but it's actually something that's sort of never gone out of fashion. Absolutely. And it's quite, it's it's not difficult to make. Um, we've got a sort of three tiers, it's a bit more drama with that. Yeah. And then we've got an orange cream cheese icing, which I really like cream cheese icing. It's just not as sweet as others. Right. Um, we've got some candied cranberries for colour as well. They're quite easy to make and a bit of extra fruit, it's always good. Yeah. And then on top, um, I've done some gingerbread trees. They don't have to be trees on top, you could make gingerbread reindeer, you could make you could make a whole gingerbread village. Whatever you? you like, you could top the cake with. Well, Claire will be coming back to take you step by step through this recipe. So don't forget to press the subscribe button and then you won't miss out. If you want any further information on any of the products you've seen today, then visit us at our website at aldi.co.uk. Or why not join in the conversation on our Facebook and Twitter pages at Aldi UK. We'll see you next time. Bye for now.